Hello friends, welcome back again to City Students Group. Today I'm going to show you guidelines to create project in Microsoft Office for 2007 or 2003 or 2010 or any of the person. So for that you need software Microsoft Office for 2007 and in this software I have here opened one Microsoft Office for 2007. So first you need to adjust the page layout okay so first go to page layout option now come down here on the margin now click on it go to custom margin and from here select top to 0.75 bottom 0.75 left 1.25 and right is 1 that is correct okay now click ok so it's good from here now go to home and now you have to select different font size and uh, fonts so for that first I'm gonna create a chapter from project and technical seminar whatever you say okay so if uh, I'm going for first chapter that is chapter 1 then select it it should be in times normal And the punch size should be 16. And this text either should be left aligned or right aligned. So I'm gonna so I'm going to align it to right. Okay. Now if I'm going to create my first chapter that is called introduction. Okay. Now select it, make it to 18 and it should be center aligned now under introduction I'm going to first heading that is first introduction to my project say anything and this should be left aligned with text size font size 16 and if I have a subheading under this heading then this would be look like 1.1 my if I'm gonna say my first subheading my first subheading okay and this would be this is okay that is left aligned only thing that you need to change is make the font size 16 to 14 okay that's it now you have to do is start writing the body text so for that first you need to go to font size and make it 12 the body text should be 12 okay now I start writing just I'm gonna type random words random text okay to show you some more things means justification in this one just a second one more line now you can see as some of the line from the right is up to here only and some line here some line ends here so for that it should look like in a straight line okay it should be ended in a straight line means it should be justified like you can see here left all the lines is going to be start from here only so the same thing should look like from the right so for that you need to select the body text part okay now go to this one this is justify click on it now you can see all the texts are justified okay now it is looking in a straight line okay so from the similar similar manner you can do all the things in the project description now I'm going to show you how to add header and footers. So for that, go to insert page header. From the list, select third one. It's better. Now write here your project title. Project 
title goes here click on this one it's added now you need to add a footer it should be here so go to again footer click third one again now type here your college name college name with department so add your college name and department names should be in just type in short like uh, for electronics and communication just type ECE and for computer science just type CS or IS or ME similar similarly civil and others and click on here so it's added and when now you will go to another page with writing it will get added automatically to the all the pages if you want to see just take a look I'm gonna insert a, another page okay like so see here it's added okay so using the similar similar manner you can do all the things okay now now if you want to add a table in this one then just go to insert table from here select uh, row and columns according to you need it okay so my table is like this and if you want to customize it with colors then here are so many colors okay and if you want to add a picture then just go to picture and from this one you can add any of the picture like if uh, I'm gonna add this one click on it insert okay. and uh, you can justify it to smaller and bigger and if you want to appear in the right side or middle or in left side and if you want to text should look in the right like in newspaper then just go to select this one picture and go to position and from here you can select different positions wherever you want okay fine now this is over now if you want to add some borders then just go to page layout and click on borders go to 3d and from here you can select like this one okay so here body is added so border is added if you want to remove this border if you if you don't want this border then don't worry just go to again page layout click on page borders select none click ok it will get automatically removed okay so the similar manner you can do all the things and uh, your project report will look great okay so this is the guidelines to create project report in microsoft office world so if you have any query you can contact me our mail id is appearing on the screen so thanks for watching it and uh, if you have any doubts then we are expecting your questions so thank you for watching god bless thanks